Hello, Pacific Baptist Church. This is Pastor Myers. I'm out here on vacation, actually stopping to get some coffee. On a Monday morning, you'll be seeing this on uh, Tuesday. And I hope you had a great uh, day at church yesterday. Uh, we were able to see the live stream last night to make sure everybody was behaving themselves. I heard we had good crowds and the services went well. And I appreciate you uh, being faithful. In the morning, we were able to go to a church here indoors. And uh, that was exciting. Of course, a lot of you heard that there was a court case that was won on Saturday uh, through John MacArthur's church, allowing people to go to church indoors. And of course, that was already struck down. But uh, church is important. And uh, we just live in some very, very difficult times, but they are exciting times. I just want to encourage you to keep going forward. We're looking forward uh, to the school year that's coming up soon. And uh, we have some plans for that. The summer is quickly coming to an end. It's been one of the more unusual summers as we've not been able to do a lot of the things. But I'm still excited about being a Christian. I'm excited about serving the Lord. And I hope that you are also. Don't let what's going on during these times keep you uh, from being excited about your faith, excited about serving the Lord. Um, it's very important that we as Christians stand up and do the right thing. Um, we have to think, Brother Chardo last night talked about the, um, uh, the next generation. It's very important that those of us now, we stand for what's right and do everything within our power to give the next generation the freedoms that we have. Now, it may happen that we lose those freedoms. Uh, we're up here right now in the Portland area, just a bunch of nonsense going on and, and a lot of craziness going on. But uh, we need to do everything we can within our, our rights uh, to uh, give our kids the freedom that we've had to live peaceably and to serve the Lord. But regardless, we need to make sure that we pass the faith on. And it's a faith that we must enjoy. It's a faith that we must be actively participating in. And I hope that you are experiencing the joy of fellowshipping with Jesus Christ, spending time in His Word. Well, we'll be back in a little over a week, and we're looking forward to it. And again, I just encourage you to be faithful, uh, be at the service on Thursday night. Um, <clears throat> you know, we watched the live stream last night, and uh, first time I've watched one of ours, I've actually been uh, preaching in most of them, but uh, it was a challenge with all of the grandkids there. But I'll tell you what, I enjoyed being able to have that, uh, that available to me, but it wasn't church. Uh, the only reason we did that, there was not an evening service in any of the churches in the area where we were, so we chose to watch ours. But if there would have been one, I would have been at church. Even though it's not our church, God wants us to be meeting together. And there's just something exciting about that. And I hope that you take advantage of it. Looking forward to seeing you again in person. And we love you. If you need anything, just let us know. God bless you.